Fighters, welcome to Action Karate On Demand. My name is Master J, and I'm here at Action Karate in beautiful Newtown, Pennsylvania. <clears throat> this is our Juniors White and Red class on the week of May 23rd, and everyone natural stands. Attention! I want to tap this leg, bring your leg all the way out, bend your knees, make a fist, cover your fist. Feet together, big circle, bow, hands behind your back. Right. Everyone repeat after me. Say to build, true confidence, I must have, knowledge in the mind, honesty in the heart, and strength in the body. Winners never quit, quitters never win, I choose to be a black belt. Very, very good team. Make sure that you let your partner know that you're gonna be needing them today. If you don't have a partner, that's okay. But mom and dad do qualify, or um, any adult that's in the house, right? You wanna make sure you have your gloves on and that you have a target handy. A target would look something like this. It has a cool action. Karate Asa Shark logo on it, and you hold it in the back. If you have um, a pillow, that will work too, or the trusty bag, okay? Now, if you don't have one of those uh, targets, just see your instructor, we'll be happy to, they'll be happy to make sure that you, um, that you, those will be available for you. Today, we are working on resilience. Everyone say resilience. Resilience, like grit, is the ability to continue under pressure. So let's get started. I want to take the right leg, bring it back, hands up, say, I am. Make sure those hands are up. Now, not down by your chest, team. It's protecting your head. So it's going to be like, these have to be like your cheeks and your eyebrows, right? Protecting your eyes, nose, ears, right? Right from here, team, we're going to take our right hand. We're going to turn our palm away, take our elbow, and draw a line. We're doing an elbow. We're hitting with this part of our arm. Ready? Seven times on the right side, then we're going to switch. Loud asa every time. Ready? One. Asa. Make sure you turn your hips. Two. Asa. Three. Asa. Four. Asa. Five. Asa. Six. Asa. Seven. Asa. Switch. Oh yeah. Make sure when you throw it, the other hand has to stay up and turn your head strong. Ready? One, eyes, two, eyes, three, eyes, four, eyes, five, eyes, six, eyes, seven, eyes, switch. Oh yeah. All right, so now we're going to throw a right elbow and then follow it with a left elbow. All right, so when I say go, you say su. Eyes are ready by the count. One, two, eyes are two, two, eyes are three, two, eyes are four, two, eyes are five, two, eyes are six, two, eyes are seven, two, eyes are jump switch. Hey. Same thing, opposite side. One, two, Ah, I notice I'm turning my head this way and this way. Ready? Two, two, ah, three, two, ah, four, two, ah, five, two, ah, six, two, ah, seven, two, ah, jump switch. Hey. All right, so now we're going to do a right elbow. A left elbow and then hands up and throw a right knee. Let's try it together. Ready? Go! Su! Su! Asa! Let's try it again. Go! Su! Su! Asa! Again. Su! Su! Asa! That's number three, four. Su! Su! Asa! Five! Su! Su! Asa! Six! Two, two, asa, seven, two, two, asa, switch, okay. Same thing, opposite side team, this time, start with the left elbow, ready, go, two, two, asa, 
side, side, two, those hands up for your knees. Two, two, outside, three, two, two, outside, four, two, two, outside, five, two, two, outside, six, two, two, outside. Notice I'm keeping my hands up. Seven, two, two, outside. Jump, switch it. Hey. All right, team, take a deep breath in through your nose. Breathe out through your mouth. It's okay to get tired, but it's not okay to quit. All right, so make sure when you do this combination, you keep your hands up. We're gonna do elbow, elbow, and then we're gonna throw up front kick. Hands up, chin up, eyes straight ahead. No reaching, hunching over, standing up the whole time. Ready? One, two. Two, asa, two, 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 asa, three, two, two, asa, four, two, two, asa, five, two, two, asa, six, two, two, asa, seven, two, two, asa, and switch. Three. Same thing, opposite side team. Let's work hard. Ready? Go. Two, two, outside. That's one. Now two, 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 outside. Three, two, two, outside. Four, two, two, outside. Five, two, two, outside. Six, two, two, outside. Seven, two, two. Outside, jump, switch, hey. All right, so your hands behind your back. Take a deep breath into your nose. Breathe out through your mouth. Awesome, awesome warm up, team. Now it's time for our partner drill. Now, team, remember, if you don't have a partner, you can do it in the air. And if you don't, um, if you have a pad, a bag, you can do it on the bag. All right, team. So I'm gonna give you seven seconds. You can also pause the video if need be. To grab your partner. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and time. We're back in, team. Make sure 100% team you have your gloves on. This is very, very important when you're striking targets. Now, uh, partner, if you have a pillow, um, you just wanna hold it just like that. They're gonna be striking this with elbows and kicks right in the middle. If you have a target, make sure you slide your hand through like this and grab. If you have two targets, that's actually optimal for today's drill. So notice I have two targets. And one thing I want you to show you is that when I'm grabbing the target, grabbing a handle, my palm is facing the target. It's not backwards, it's, it's, you're holding it like that. And my thumb is kind of out so that it doesn't get twisted when I move around, okay? For today's drill, I'm actually gonna use one target because that's probably uh, the one that we can use for today, right? <clears throat> I'm gonna use the bag as my partner today, okay? So team, what we're gonna do is 40 seconds strong, we're gonna have our right leg back and we're gonna hit that target with our right elbow and our left elbow. A right elbow and our left elbow. So it's gonna look just like this. Can you watch here? I have my right leg back, my hands up, so I'm gonna go zoom, ah, side, hands up. Now I'm gonna go faster. Zoom, ah, side, 40 seconds, non stop. I need some resilience here. So, in order to get that, that, that push you need, you have to push yourself. You gotta say, I can go faster, I can go harder, I can hit the pad stronger. Pad holders, make sure you're careful, okay? Ready? 40 seconds on the clock, starting now. Okay. Zoom out, 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 Zoom out. Technique, right? Super awesome. And then I get my hands up. 
So they can get a good strong kick towards the partner. Ready, set, let's go team, let's build our resilience. Go, shoot, shoot, get away, ah, a strong kick, get with the ball on your foot. Shoot, shoot, ah, keep working team, just listen to me. Ah, elbow, elbow, back up. same time, right? 
So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our right leg. So I'm gonna tap your right leg with me. Good. You're gonna step back and pull your elbows close to your body and your palms are gonna face your head. And that's a good place to start. What we're doing is their grip, the bully's grip is like this, and you're pulling out of their thumbs, which is the weakest part of the grip. Okay? So let's do it together. Everyone, natural stance. Spread your fingers apart like this. It's a cool trick to know. Step back with your right leg. Pull your elbows to your body. Pull your palms up towards your face. Right? And say, back! All right, let's do it together. One natural stance. Spread your fingers apart. Step back and say, back! Good. You're pulling your arms out of that, out of that double grip. Ready? Everyone say, and do I want to say two self defense against a two hand grab. Go, or two, two hand wrist grab. Sorry, two hand wrist grab. Ready? One, say back. Good. Now, right from here, you're going to close your fist up, protect your head. Oh, I'm sorry, you're not going to close your fist up. You're going to have your hands open. You're going to push their hands down because their hands are probably like this too. You're going to push their hands down, then bring your hands up and throw a fast front kick right to their belly or to their head or below their belt, right? And everyone say, kick! Good, let's do those two moves together. There's still more, okay? Everyone, natural stance, spread your fingers apart. Everyone, oops, sorry. Everyone say, and hook. Say, defense against a two-hand wrist grab. Right, spread your fingers apart, step back, and say, back! Good, now knock their hands down, bring your hands up, throw a kick, say, kick! All right, let's make those two moves a little bit faster. Right, so when I say go, when I say one, step back and say back, bring your hands up. Now when I say two, we're gonna throw the kicks, okay? We're gonna knock your hands down, bring our hands up, and throw one fast, strong kick to the belly. Ready? One, say back! Two, say kick! See how fast I did that, team? Let's try again, ready? One, say back! Two, say kick! Good, good, good. Knock their hands down there like this. Hit them right in the belly. Now we're gonna finish it with our strong move. This is actually like the end of move. We're gonna take both of our hands and put our wrists together and our palms are not touching like this. It's actually open like this and this is called a butterfly palm. You're hitting with both palms right into their solar plexus, right? Not, not there, you could hit them in the belly, that'll count too. Not there, you could hit them in the ribs, but right here in the center of their body, bazooka like that, that is the uh, winner on the chicken dinner, right? So let's add that move in there. I want natural stance, I want to say Advil. I want to say two hand wrist grab, right? Step back with your right leg and say back. Knock them down, hands up, say kick. Get your butterfly strike, notice I bend my knees, to push your body in, hit them strong. Say, asa! Stop, stay back. Natural stance, let's try it again, ready? Everyone say, and go. Self-defense against a two-hand wrist grab. Ready? One, say, back! Two, say, kick! Three, say, asa! Stop, stay back. Now, one of the instructors gave me like the coolest analogy that I really like, like if you ever played like Dragon Ball Z or Street Fighter for my older students, right? They throw their hands out like this and a fireball comes flying out and that's kind of the kind of strength you want to use here. Ready, natural stance, and boom. Defense against the two hand wrist grab. Ready, one, say back. Kick, it's two, three, asa. Stop, stay back. All right, team, so what I'm gonna have you do, you can do it with a partner, in the air, or even on the back. You're gonna do it one time, and then you're gonna run over, probably a few feet away, about six, seven feet away from my back. I'm gonna run over seven feet away from the back, and I'm gonna throw seven jab crosses. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, not seven punches, Seven combinations, jab, cross. If you're a leadership team member, I need 10 combinations from you. All right, so this is what it looks like on the back or with a partner. 
You're grabbing your wrist, you're stepping back. You say back, hands up. You kick the target over, you come close to your partner, you don't kick your partner. Right, you say kick, you come close to your partner, and you strike down, and you say asa, and you have your back, you say asa, you go back, you say asa on the back, and then stop, stay back. Run over here for your combo. Ready? We're gonna go. Probably about one minute strong. Ready? Set your bananas. And go! Back! Kick! Ah, stop, stop, stay back! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I have to do ten because I'm a black belt. Ready? Back! Kick! I'm going to give you about seven seconds, or you can pause the video. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Parents, thank you for joining us. Adults, thank you for joining us. I need two thumbs up from you, just like this. Very, very good. Now, <clears throat> who can tell me what skill we are working on today? Start to an R. Kind of means grip a little bit. That's right, everyone say resilience. Very, very good. Re we said resilience is like grit. And it's okay to want to quit sometimes. Is that true? It is, right? It's okay to want to quit. But when things get hard, what do we do? Do we give up? Throw in the towel? No, we keep on trying, right? The stronger we make our resilience muscle, the easier it is to push through when things are tough. Everyone, close your eyes. Mom and dad, you too. Take a deep breath in through your nose. Breathe out through your mouth. Now right now, I want you to make a promise to yourself, keep your eyes closed, that the next time something is tough, here in action or at school or with your family, you're not going to give up. You're going to keep, you're going to push through it. All right, everyone open your eyes. Take your hands, put them on. When I say, what's our goal? Put them behind your back. When I say, what's our goal? You say, black belt, excellence, sir. What's our goal? Black belt, excellence, sir. Very good job, team. Now, one exercise is for my basic members, and then I have some exercises for our black belt, uh, black belt leadership team. Um, they're gonna be doing weapons, but leadership team, if you'd like to join us in this part, you are more than welcome. We're gonna do, be doing push-up practice, okay? We're also gonna be trading kicks with our partner using touch pressure or the bag or the target. The choice is yours. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna swoop. I'm gonna spend, sorry team, I'm gonna spend one minute on the techniques of a push-up, okay? Now, if you really, really, really got the greatest at push-ups, I want you to grab a pillow or a target, okay? Okay, now, this is what I want you to do. I learned these, they're pretty cool, they're called cavemen. 
push-ups, right? And what you're gonna do is you're going to stretch your body onto the plank. You put your hands on each side of the target. You're gonna take your knees off the ground. Try to stretch your body out the best you can. You're gonna bring your chest down to the target. Now my knees are not touching the ground, only my chest. My belly's not touching the ground, my belt kind of is, but that's okay. And then I'm pushing myself up, right? So my elbows kind of, when I come down, my elbows flare out, which is good, and then I push my body up. Notice I'm not looking down at my feet or looking straight ahead, I can look just straight down on the ground, and that's okay. Bend my elbows, and then straighten my elbows. Bend my elbows and straighten my elbows. And you can rest a little bit of the weight on the target, that's okay. Now, if you are like intermediate level at push-ups, take that pad away. And if you notice the pad was about three inches from the ground, now you're gonna be here. We're gonna try to do five knees together. Straighten your body out, knees off the ground. You're, notice my hands are not like this. They're a, a little wider than my shoulders. Okay, so I'm here, I'm gonna come down, but I'm not gonna let anything touch the ground. And I push up, elbows bend, elbows straight. That's two, tighten your belly if you can, all those muscles in your, around your belly button. Ready, bend your elbows, straighten your elbows. That's three, bend your elbows, straighten your elbows. Four, five, bend your elbows, straighten your elbows. Now, team, let's say you're amazing at push-ups. You're the super, super, super best. You're gonna do a push-up, and then you're gonna chop up towards the sky. Ready, let's try this together. Ready? One, ah, sky. Two, ah, sky. Three, ah, sky. Four, ah, sky. One more. Five, ah, sky. Now, I'm not gonna say they're my favorite push-ups, right? But they are important to develop the muscles in our body for our kicks and punches. Okay, now, while I'm working with the leadership team, you can grab a partner, seven seconds, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. If you have a partner, you're gonna bring your right leg back, hands up, you're gonna throw a front kick and you're gonna touch their belt like this. Ah, that's in their turn. Make sure, adults, parents, <laughs> that you don't have your shoes on, okay? And touch them lightly on their belt. And if you're a little afraid to, to touch them, just throw the kick close to them, but without hitting, right? So, zoom, asa, asa, asa. If you have a bag, just keep going at it for at least two minutes straight. Set a timer and get started. Now, my leadership team, Guess why? I give you permission to take off your gloves. Okay? We are gonna start our Arnis Kata. So I want you to go grab your Arnis sticks. Go ahead, team. I have mines here. Now, remember last week we talked about showing respect. So we're gonna get on our knees, it stays in style. We're gonna take our, our knee sticks, put them on the ground. We're gonna make our hands like a diamond and bow, showing respect. Now, really quick, I'm gonna go through the rules team. When we have our knee sticks, we treat our weapon with respect. Um, and now just treat them like a baby, right? Would you throw a baby on the ground? If you're done, if you're done no, right? Say no way, Master J, right? Uh, would you, if you're, we're sitting there, you need to move them, would you kick them? No, right, you have to treat them with respect. Make sure you have a good practice area, talk to mom and dad of where a good practice area would be. Maybe the living room is not the best place to practice our knee sticks because there's lamps or special bases, right? So make sure that you talk to mom and dad and get a good practice area, okay? So take your, our knee sticks, and remember, we're gonna leave a little bit of space, about an inch of space in the bottom. You're gonna put them right in your chest. You're gonna bow like this. You're gonna grab one in your other hand. Spread your feet apart into a horse stance position. Bring them both to one side. And repeat after me, say tornado. Good, now team, you're gonna take your right hand. You're gonna swing and say one. You're gonna swing it back and say two. 
Again, take this hand and say three, and then come back and say four. Let's work on those moves, ready? Right hand goes first, say one, across, and bring it back, two. So stay with me, okay, team? Now the opposite hand, say three, and bring it back, say four. Good, say one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. All right, time now, team. We're gonna start from here, right? And we're gonna go one, and then two, and then three, and then four. Now we're gonna go low, we're gonna go one, I'm sorry, we're gonna go five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so let's do the five, six, seven, eight part, and then we'll put them together. Last week's drill and this week's drill. Right, so it's five, six, seven, eight. Let's do it again, five, six, seven, eight. So your right hand is going on five, across, six coming back, then your left hand, seven across, eight coming back. Five, six, seven, eight. All right, let's put them two together, okay? Ready, so we're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And time. Put your arm sticks together. Bow. Team, don't worry. We're going to practice more of our knees. But practice those eight moves when you have time. Like right now, our practice time took about two minutes. Find two minutes in the day to practice your kata. Stay in that core stance. Eyes straight ahead. Stay focused. Okay? Now, quick announcements before we end out our class. Fathers Train Free in the month of June. Really super excited. So make sure you contact your instructor or your enrollment director and get them, get mom and dad, sorry, get mom and dad, dad all set up for his first karate class. Okay, for those of you who are following on demand schedule, I want you to send a video to your instructor of and the room. Back, kick, and then asa, stop, stay back, okay? Now, let's bow out team. You guys did a fantastic job. Everyone attention. <laughs> Cap his leg, bring him all the way out. Deep four stands, bend your knees. Make a fist, cover your fist. Team, did we sweat today? Team, did we learn today? Team, did we have fun today? Absolutely. Feet together, big circle down, A, B, C. Have a great week.